Hi, my name is Brian, and I'm going to show you my idea for a carpet kit or bed for camping in. It's a great place to put your inflatable mattress, which is great for your back. And uh, this is the most inexpensive, efficient, quick, easy to build, cool way to do this that I've found. So, and uh, nobody had what I was looking for, so this is what I came up with. When you look in the back of a truck, you'll notice that there's cutouts for different size wood. When you look at your wheel wells, the wheel wells are slotted for a 2x6. So what I did is I took some carpet and filled the whole back of the truck with carpet. And then I also took the scrap leftover pieces and stapled them onto the board so that the planks don't rattle with the rest of it. I cut one of these funny to go up in the front. That would be that one. And one of the two by sixes goes in the back. And you just dump these in here. You put in one end and then the other. And it makes a platform. You'll see it come together here as I do this. Remember the secret combination. All right, so there's your planks. Next up, I've got these boards. I do them rough side up so carpet doesn't slide around near so much as it would otherwise. You have to buy two four by eight sheets because a four by eight sheet by itself doesn't fill out the whole bed. It fits in the middle. So, you do one, you do the other. You'll notice that near my right hand, just slide the one sheet on the other, on my right hand I've got a cut out for this, and the rest is just kind of a squiggle to accommodate for the wheel well extra stuff. Every truck's different, so you have to just kind of cut your own. But uh, now I've got a nice, even, flat surface to put the air mattress on. And I have storage for all the tools and things I want to haul underneath. Next thing you do is you take your carpet, look to see which side has the snaps and which has the rest. Notice at the end here I have snaps put in, and I have corresponding snaps that go onto the tailgate. This just makes every life more simple um, for your privacy, for keeping stuff in, and it keeps a barrier between the tailgate and the other for dust. It looks kind of wrinkly now, but put it out in the sun for 10, 20 minutes, and it'll just be flat as flat. So just tuck the extra in there. Close it up, and that's how we roll. It keeps all the dust and stuff out from where your bedding is going to be. Let me show you around inside. What I've done here is I put in a power outlet so I can run my laptop out here, and then I've also done a little four wire flat. And the reason I did that is so. I can have light for my little LED that lights it up really good in here. It's got one of those LED plates in there. And then also I've got a brake light that's up there and it's hooked up. So I have three wires total. I've got a ground wire, I've got a brake light wire, and I have a uh, power wire for the dome light there. And uh, that's the setup and it's worked pretty good. I've been using this for about four or five years now and I really like it but it is a little bit of work putting the shell on the truck all the time so we got the tent trailer the tent trailer sleeps eight this will sleep three kids or two adults 
You just throw in the air mattress and then the air mattress comes up to about here. But it's a pretty slick little setup. It's not too bad.